Hi everyone, it's Angela here. Hope everyone's fine. Yeah, today I want to show you um, a useful thing in SharePoint called an alert. So SharePoint alert. So what is a SharePoint alert? SharePoint alert is basically um, an email notification alerting you of a change in your document library, your folder, a list. Um, you can set it on any item really. So I'm going to quickly show you and I hope it's useful. So on my, I'm in my SharePoint team site here. Now a useful use case would be in my client document library area. So this is a document library that I share with my clients and I want to know when something is changed. So I can click on these three dots here and alert me and then I get a page come up for my options now because I'm an administrator of this site I will see more than you would see when you're setting up an alert because I can set up the alert for someone else I can add someone as a SharePoint admin um, but you probably just have um, a, a shorter version of this um, so that you set it up for yourself so in my alert I have so many options or triggers so I can say only send me an alert when new items are added say I'm expecting something from my clients existing items are modified and so forth but, but for the sake of this demonstration I'm going to leave it to um, any change that happens for this um, folder that I've selected um, so yep so what needs to happen if someone else has changed the document so so many options so you tick what you prefer now this is an important one do you want a daily summary do you want immediately i mean it can be overwhelming if you have loads of stuff in there and you want an alert for everything then that will be overwhelming so but for the sake of this demo i'm going to leave it on here and then i say okay now once i okay that I would get an email saying my alert has been successful and therefore um, if I just go to an email here and uh, there you go my alerts on that has been successfully set up so I get that now you don't have to have an alert on a whole folder or a document library you can have an alert even on an item so say let's say this is a financial report it's important I need to know I can do that as an alert here and again you know so by clicking that the alert will only be on that um, item that which is the report but you can set it on a folder if you're expecting a few things it then and I still use here and go for an alert so you know SharePoint has many ways of um, doing something so once I've done that I've set up my alert I'm gonna um, um, I'm gonna be someone else and um, add an item and then we should see how that works so I've just switched screens to um, the client I'm now the client as you can see it's an external address from my main SharePoint but they have access and they're able to go in here and make an amendment so because i set it on the alert on the actual folder city silver city uh, when they open something it should trigger i'll open this one make an amendment maybe uh maybe delete this slide because i i as a client don't feel that it's needed it's fine and then that it's saved because it's practically saved I've come out of there and so if we go back to my email there you go I and this is me as you can see here uh, potential da, 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 has been changed and who by and when and there you go so this is how useful it is to have an alert on your document um, not all documents unless you need it or a folder for a special you know often when you're working with clients something like that would be useful to have um, yeah I hope you found this useful and um, 
uh, let me know if you have anything else that you would like me to cover and we can do that this is how you set an alert on the sharepoint online thank you don't forget to subscribe and to yeah and to comment bye see you next time